welcome back to Good Day, everybody. Time for the day of this now this morning. You know, just because you don't have kids, don't bypass the baby oil at the store. On the day list this morning, I've got three ingenious uses for this overlooked substance. Number one, Remove a bandage. I want to rip one of those things off. It hurts, all right? You can eliminate or at least significantly lessen the ouch factor on kids and subsequent tears when removing a band aid by first rubbing a little baby oil into the adhesive parts on top and around the edges of the bandage. If you see it beginning to kind of work loose, uh, you can let the child kind of finish the job rubbing that uh, oil in there and help them overcome the fear of that pain. Adults who have sensitive or fragile skin may also want to try that. It'll uh, really help get that off a little bit easier. Number two, golfers, buff up your golf clubs. That's right. You don't want to waste your money on fancy cleaning kits for those chrome plated carbon steel golf club heads. Just keep a little bottle of baby oil in your golf bag along with a chamois cloth or a towel. Just dab a few drops of oil onto the cloth and polish the heads of the clubs after each round or before if you want to impress your foursome at the tee box. And number three, this is a nice little tip too. It'll help shine up a stainless steel sink and also chrome trim around uh, your sink and appliances. You can pamper up dull looking stainless steel sinks and spotted sinks by rubbing them down with a little bit of baby oil on a soft, clean cloth. You can rub it dry then with a towel. Repeat if necessary. Get a great shine on your kitchen. It's also a great way to remove, like I said, the stains on chrome trim of the around the sink or on the kitchen appliances and also in uh, the bathroom there where things tend to get a little uh, spotted from all that uh, moisture in there. More tips on ways to use baby oil at home you may not have thought of. A link to GoodDaySacramento.com. Click Show Info there at the top of the page. And then today's name. Genius. Genius. Well, a woman in North Carolina